guys, welcome back to another video where today we've got something super excited and uh, yes, you're going to absolutely love this. As you can see next to me, we have got the menu to get into accurate Rainbow Friends roleplay for chapter 2. So if we hit this button here, it all should look pretty familiar and I am so excited. So, oh, check this out. So we've got the main characters in here. Which I can see there's yellow inside already. This is a good start. And I can see there is a Lucky on the floor. I don't know if that's someone being it or if it's just rolling freely at this point. That is someone. Hey, we got ourselves a little Lucky army. And obviously we got the big Lucky here. I'm going to assume that's twisted because we have got him in the game with us today. Oh, so what's around this corner? This is so cool. I wonder how much of the actual map is working. Like... If you have all the rides that are usable, it could be really cool in the fact that you can actually chill out on the rides. Like, you can enjoy them without the others trying to kill you. I know, that's so cool. But I can see straight away that this is the lobby. Hey, we've got the generator. Uh, so we can't use the generator, which is fair enough. I mean, it's only a little thing. It's a cool little gimmick in the main game. And we've got the way to go back to chapter one. I'm quite curious if we run into it. Yep, that's good. At least it doesn't take you to chapter one. Now, I did see there's a little gap down here. So before we go into the main characters, I'm just going to head down where it says the extra characters. What extras could there be? Wait, is that right? With a switch on his hand? We could literally be like setting fireworks off. Ah, oh, that's so cool. I can see someone's already become red. But what else have we got here? So, we've got the pushy pack. Wait, I remember this from chapter one. Of course, of the accurate Rainbow Friends roleplay, chapter one. That's actually pretty cool. I wonder if we've got any new ones down here as yet. So, we got pink. Hey, that's cool. The other yellow. The one that we all thought was going to be the new one, but clearly it wasn't. We got with the blue. We got Easter Friends. The Rainbow Friend. The version of blue that changes color. And you got brown concept. Hey, I remember this in the daycare attendant. This is amazing. So we've got like the sign that we thought could potentially be what was going to be in chapter two, as well as our yellow over here that we were so certain was going to be in chapter two. And ended up it wasn't. We've got something actually really, really cool. So we have got ourselves blue, green, orange. Hey, you can be orange, even though he's in the game for literally like five seconds. You've got a reset switch. Hey, that's quite useful. And then you got cyan and yellow. Oh, you know what? I really want to try both of these and we're going to do exactly that. We're going to start with yellow. Guys, check all of this out. I don't know why I'm crying. I must be so happy. But annoyingly, my big fat head is in the way. But you've got a whole bunch of stuff here, which are different options. Hey, this is cool. We've actually got chapter two. And look at the walk animation. He does that cute kind of little walk where he holds his hands together. That's so cool. Oh, the doors work as well. Oh, that's amazing. I got Sage going. Wait, that's yellow. Why is he so adorable? Look at him. He's so cute. Cool. Look at the map. I can see the windmill spinning in the little place that you can hide in. We've got rainbow races. Our oh, greens ride. This is amazing. We've literally got everything in Purple's Lair. Hey, you can actually go to Purple's Lair and not be worried about being caught by Purple. That's actually pretty cool. But yeah, I obviously haven't had a look at these yet. So what have we got? We've got sound effects. So we've got Friends Spotted. Ah, oh, the iconic sound of blue and everyone spotting you. And then if we go to Friends Closer. Oh, that's cool. So when they get to close proximity, you hear that sound. What's this? Oh, it's the alternative sound of them being really near. Oh, this is so cool. Check this out. But hang on, we've got Toggle Fly, Toggle Chase, Roam, Jump Scare, Aggro. There's so much here. Oh, let's check out the Roam. Oh, it's more sound effects. That's so cool. And it's bespoke to Cyan as well. What about the Aggro? Ah, oh, that's so cool. The fact you can do these on demand. You can do some really cool RPing in this. And we got ourselves a jump scare. Wow, that's so well done. It's just like the real thing. That's so cool. And I've just seen Sage just going on to Blue's little Ferris wheel. I say it's little. It's actually huge. Look at it. But hey, we got Toggle Chase and Toggle Fly. <gasps> so we do Toggle Chase. Okay, maybe we just move. 
Oh, check it out. Look at this. And you can do the sound at the same time. That's amazing. I love how quick he goes. He's so fast. But if we turn it back off. Oh, you go back to the cute walking pose. But we got toggle fly. Does this mean we can actually fly? This is going to be so cool. I mean, even if we get the sounds of the engine and we can, like, get our feet off the floor, that would definitely be a winner. So let's press the button. Wow! It's got all the sound effects. And look, we are gliding. Oh, look, our feet don't touch the floor. We're literally gliding along. That's amazing. Oh, this is so cool. But wait, this is only yellow. Hang on. What happens if I press the button again? Oh, it lands super smooth and goes back to the walking animation. You know what? That's actually a really nice touch. So straight back, we've have respawns. Let's check outside over here. Obviously, blue, green, and orange. I have a feeling we know what they're like. I'm just really curious to try out these two new characters for this video in chapter two. RP, obviously, because look at this. I <laughs> so adorable. And again, we have got so many different options here. Look at this. Jump scare, laugh, aggro. We got a toggle of chase, focus, and chomp. What? We can do chomping on demand. That's amazing. Let's head over to the other map. So just like this. Straight back to here. Let's go through. Ah, oh, this is amazing. You can actually act like your scion. Oh, amazing. And I think that Cyan is actually, like, faster than Yellow. She is pretty quick. Like, when she chases you, you gotta be on the ball. But let's check it out. So we've got ourselves the aggro sounds. Amazing. And yes, I would love to test it. We can do a race routine shortly. Let's just go through this and we can do a little race. Ah, this is gonna be so much fun. So we had the aggro and we got laugh. That sounds amazing. It sounds so happy for something that's so adorably cute. I think that's perfect. We got the jump scare. Wow, that's so accurate. Okay, and then we've got ourselves toggle chase, toggle focus. Wait, is this when it does the cool kind of like Sona thing and just kind of targets the enemy like when they move? And she's like, and yeah, so it's like, what? <laughs> It is exactly that. And it's got the sound effects. That's amazing. Oh, that is so, so cool. Oh, and then you can turn off and move around again. You got Toggle Chomp. Oh, I think that's when it gets excited and uh, she starts chasing you. Or I have seen that happen, actually. When Science chasing me, I go into somewhere like this. And then Science head kind of goes through and ends up doing this. Oh, it is. It's identical. Amazing. And the fact it's toggable makes it even better. So I got Twisted saying try chase and chomp at the same time. To be fair, we haven't even tried chase yet. You're right. So let's do chase. Oh, look at that. We are, we are quick. We are moving so fast. And then if you say do chomp at the same time. Oh, that's so cool. Look at this. This would be terrifying to have chasing after you at this speed. But you know what? That is so, so cool. We need to do this little race between Yellow and Cyan. And I think we're just going to do a real simple drag race where we start at the bouncy castle. And we just have to make it to Blue's castle over there. A nice, short, easy race. So if we stand next to the, uh, the toilets as a starting line... And I will count us down. So are you ready, Yellow? Then yes, I am ready. Let's go. So three, two, one, go. Wow, Yellow's actually super quick. Actually, I think, honestly, even though I was slightly ahead, I actually think they run at the same speed, which is uh, actually pretty cool because it means whichever one you choose to be to chase other people around the map, you're going to be in for a good time because you're going to be able to capture them all. And, well, yeah, made them have a bad day. I just had a really, really cool idea. And that is, uh, at the moment, we are Cyan. And, I mean, if you can be Cyan, wouldn't it be absolutely awesome to uh, be able to catch someone and be just like Cyan at this point? I mean, we need to find someone to come around and we can maybe target them as our victim. Wait, 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 wait. Just like that. Oh, he's saying, hi, Cyan, you're my favorite character. But he stood still for a while, so I'm going to come on focus and move. Just literally over here. Make it look quite natural. You know how it is. Cyan is, like, so adorable. Oh, 
I saw him move again. Oh, he's not moving. Wait, wait, wait. He's off. <gasps> Aggro sounds. And we're going to chase him. Look at us go. Oh, look at this. Oh, he's screaming. He's going, no. Oh, wait. I can go faster. <gasps> oh, we got him. Yeah, we got ourselves our first person as Cyan. Oh, that's so cool. And guess what, guys? You can do it as well by joining this game where you can play as all of these creatures. But there's more to that. There is. Okay, guys, that's where I'm going to end the video today. If you liked it, remember to hit the like button, subscribe if you haven't done so already. It's super appreciated. And we will catch you in the next video. Remember to boot the snoop.